welcome back to my channel. I'm Daniela, your independent Scentsy consultant, and today I have Melting Monday. If you don't know, Melting Monday is where I share everything that I've been melting from the previous Saturday through Friday. And um, yeah, I'm going to rate them as well. Um, ones are not for me. I won't even melt it, so none of these are ones. Um, a two is, it's all right, I'll melt it, probably don't love it. A three is, um, I like it, I'll probably get more in clearance or um, if there was a sale. A four is definitely a repurchase, I really like it or love it. And then a five is absolutely going to club it. So, um, or it's already clubbed or it has been clubbed um, or I wish I could club it. Um, so... I'll let you know where I warmed everything and also the scent notes. So let's get started. The first one is Fluffy Fleece. And I warmed this in my bedroom and it is... Fluffy Fleece is Black Current Cozy Musk and Heliotrope. This is in my club right now, so it's a five. I just love this. This and Forever Flannel are two of my favorites. Um, Forever Flannel you can't get, so if you're looking for a good like laundry scent or cozy scent, I love this at night like in my bedroom because it just like smells like clean laundry and I just feel like so cozy when I go to sleep. Um, so I love that one. Next up is Sunshine Mango and this is actually the scent of the month for April, so this is going to be coming out soon. And I melted this in the dining room and it is red mango, golden pineapple, and tropical orange. This is good. It definitely is mango heavy, so it's probably not a repurchase for me. Um, plus I have like several bars of it now because I get the scent of the month. Um, well, I got the scent and the warmer of the month for April and that video will be coming in a couple days. Um, but I like it. It's I don't need more of it um, because I have so many, but it may, might be a repurchase in the future if I go through the ones that I have. So I do really like it. So it's a four, but yeah, I don't know. Um, next up is Watermelon Tangerine. This is an all-time favorite of mine. It is a five. I have had this in my club um, during fall and winter and it is available now during the spring and summer uh, catalog so I did not take it out um, but this was in the half bath and it is uh, watermelon slices juicy tangerine and dewy greens I love this love it this is a new bar but oh I just love it I, it's it's in my I have a bar of it in my classroom because the kids love this one too. It's just like such a good one. Everybody loves it. So um, definitely a five. It will go back in my club at the end of the season um, just to make sure that I don't lose it. Um, next is Lemon Lime Fizz. And this is part of the Easter collection. And this is warmed in the kitchen. And it is... Vanilla sugar, fizzing lemon, and lime. Um, I really like this one. It smells like lemon pez to me. It's kind of in the middle of lemon sorbet, which I feel lemon sorbet is very like lemon head. Kind of got that tart note to it. Um, and just like lemon, any other lemon scented thing that's more sweet. Um, this is kind of right in the middle. So this is really good. I have repurchased this. Um, so it's a four for me, but I don't know that I'm going to club it. I do like it a lot though. Um, next is Starburst Sky. This is one of the new ones for this season. Um, it was in the bathroom and it is, it's not new for this season. That's a lie. Um, it's new to me this season because it wasn't in last season as far as I know, but, um, it's new to me. <laughs> it is sweet apple, whipped vanilla, creamy coconut, and amber blossom. So it also comes in the, um, the, what's it called? Body care line. 
I really liked this. It's got like a kind of sweet note to it, but it's still, it still was good in the bathroom. Um, I don't know what it is about it. So I really like this one. This is probably a four. I'll probably repurchase it. Um, if I haven't already, I might have. I definitely liked that one. Next up is Candy Orchard, and this was warmed in my classroom. This one's funny because the kids always, like, any kids that are walking by outside are like, what is, what, what's that smell? <laughs> it smells like cotton candy to me. Um, where is it? Sorry, I'm looking on my spreadsheet and it's always hard to find what I'm looking for. Uh, spun sugar, sweet raspberry, and warm vanilla. So it definitely smells like cotton candy to me. It's not like overly sweet candy scent. Um, probably not a repurchase. I have a lot of them because of scent of the month, but um, this was the scent of the month for January. But I don't know. I might, if it was in clearance or something, I might, would, maybe, maybe, I don't know. Um, next up is Rainbow Sherbert. And this was in the kitchen. And this is a five. I had this in my club before during the fall and winter season and took it out because you can get it now, but it was in my club and I'll go back in my club. It's orange zest, sugared strawberry, and key lime. This just smells so good. Like when this is warming, I don't even know what it is. It just is so good. It's so good. I just love it. I don't even know how to describe it. Um, good is how I describe that one. Next is Monsters Inc. Monstropolis. This was also in my classroom. This is a favorite in my classroom. Um, the kids love it. It is, where is it? Uh, Mandarin, watermelon, pineapple, and lush palms. Um, I This is in my club already, so it's a five. I usually do like the fruity scents in my classroom because all the kids seem to like the fruity scents and it doesn't really bother anyone, so that's what I usually pick, but that is a favorite in my classroom. Next up is Mocha Doodle. And Mocha Doodle was in my bedroom and it is. Can't find it. There it is. Coffee beans, cocoa, sugar, caramel, and heavy cream. This is. I don't know how to feel about this. I. I like it on warm. I like it better on warm than I do on cold. But still, it's not like my favorite coffee scent that I've ever smelled. So um, it's definitely better than like the Friends Bar. But yeah, it's not my favorite coffee scent. So it's probably a three. I don't even know if it's a three. Maybe a two or a three. In between a two and a three. It'd have to be a good price, I think. Um... This is in the catalog right now, and it was in the catalog last season, and I have this is the only bar of it I have. Um, well, I, I don't have any anymore <laughs> because I used it all. Um, just not my favorite. Not my favorite. Next is Amazon Rain. This is a favorite. This is a five. If it ever were to leave the catalog, it is in the catalog right now, and it is Melon, Orange Zest, Coconut Milk, and Jasmine, and I wore this in the media room. It's just so good. I don't I don't know what it is about this scent. I have no idea what it is about the scent, but I just love this one so much. Um it's just like fruity but fresh but sweet. I don't know. I just really love this one. So that's a five. It's um not in my club because you can get it and it hasn't come out of the catalog at all. So um next up is Dumbo Circus Parade, and this was in the dining room, and this is, let me find it, I can never find things when I'm looking for them, um, there it is, Sweet Clementine, Creamy Peach, Fresh Mango, and Vanilla Bean. I really like this one, this is the one, was it this one? Or was it the other one? One of these, they were in my club originally, and then I took it out. It might have been the other one. It might have been Soar, Soar High in the Sky or something. I don't think I have this one in my club at all. 
but I really like it and I, I don't really regret taking it out because like I don't need like a $400 club but yeah I don't know like I, I feel like I should have gotten more I have a couple of more bars it's a new one I have a couple more bars but maybe I should have gotten more I don't know um it's a four like I definitely repurchased it but yeah I don't know Next is Breakfast in Bed, and this was in my bedroom, I think, yeah. Um, this is, do I have the scent notes for this? I don't. I don't have the scent notes for this. Um, oh, wait, yes, I do. Warm pumpkin pastry, black raspberry, and sweet caramel drizzle. I did. I just, it's late. It's so good. I love this one. Um, this is coming back, I believe, in the Bring Back My Bars for July? June? July? When do they do that? July. I think it's July. Um, January, and then I think July is when they do the Bring Back My Bars, and I'm pretty sure that this was on the list. So, um, I've already repurchased. I got three bars of this. Um, when it comes back, I might put it in my club. It's like four or five. I have to decide. <laughs> it might go in my club. It might not. So, um, going back and forth on that one. Next up is It's a Small World, the happiest cruise that ever sailed. And this was in my classroom also. Warmed a lot of things in my classroom this week. Um, I got another warmer in there. Well, the rainbow warmer that you'll see. Friday maybe um I'm trying to think I think on Friday is when I did the April sun warmer of the month but I brought it to my classroom so I have two warmers in my classroom now so I had to switch out the wax so that I had the same scent in both of them um because I wanted it to be the same scent throughout my classroom it's a it's not that big of a classroom but it's big enough like I could smell it with one warmer just fought, like okay but my desk is on the opposite side of the classroom as where my warmer was so I wanted a second warmer in there and so I had to switch out the wax and put in new wax so that I had the same wax on across the room that was long-winded explanation of nothing okay what is this um small world why can I not find you no oh, there it is Peruvian lime apple and sweet fruit sugar this is interesting I liked it at first and now I don't really love it um the kids do like it but I don't really love this one it's just I think it's the the lime in here I like lime but this one for some reason there's something I don't know that I don't love so it's like a three I'd probably repurchase more if it was on clearance or something I'm not really sure um next up is sun castles and this is one of the new scents for the spring and summer catalog this was in my bathroom and it is sunny coconut tropical pistachio and sweet almond This is good. It smells like, um, just like a tropical, tropical vacation. Like you're by the pool with a fancy drink or something like that. Um, I like it a lot. It's probably a four. I would probably repurchase. It's not one that I'm going to warm all the time, but I would probably at least get a couple more. I think I already have. I don't really know. Um, next one is almond croissant and this was in the living room. And this is croissant, cinnamon sugar, and almond. This is really good. I like this one. Um, I like bakery scents. It's not my favorite bakery scent I've ever smelled, but it's definitely a good one. So, and then the last one that I have is a like little what do we call these? Tester cups. Little tester cup of Pacific Mist. And they came in these, they used to come in these for your, like, the scent of the month for the next month would come in the whiff box and they would come in this instead of a full bar. And lately they've been sending full bars instead of these like little tester cups. 
Um, I have another one from a long time ago. I just like never used it for some reason. So I decided to use this one and I used it in my bathroom also. And it is, why can I not find it? Misty Ocean Air, Coastal Sea Salt, and Driftwood, and Tropical Nectar. Can I still smell it? I mean, it's all right. Pacific Mist isn't my favorite scent, but I just wanted to use up the tester cup. I still have like a, I think, pink leather little tester cup like that. And then I don't think I have any other ones. So um, that is everything that I've been warming for the last week. And if you like these Melting Mondays, please click like, subscribe to my channel so you see the next one and let me know what have you been melting this week thanks for watching and i'll see you next time Bye.